And what is up guys, Tacticals here. Baby did a bad, bad thing. I did the one thing that miners are not supposed to do, that everyone says not to do, I went ahead and did it. Scrolling my feed and seeing that everybody and their mother has already gotten their Ice River AL0. They're putting out videos on it. I'm left empty handed, although my friends at Yes Mining claim that they're sending me one to take a look at. I thought I need to do something different. I need to get out ahead of it. So I did the bad. I'm the Technicals, let's get into it. If you're not already subscribed to the channel for more content like this, Yes Mining didn't pay me for this video, but they did say that they were going to send me an AL0. So I'm taking them on their word for that. So I figured I'd promote them. If you head over to yesmining.io and go to shop, ASIC Miner, Ice River, and select the AL0, their pricing is actually pretty good this time around. So if you go over here, they've got it listed at $739, which is an option, the uh, the 831 to 910 pre-order. But that's basically now. So it's going to be, it's basically spot, but technically still a pre-order. We add it to the cart and go over here. If you use code M20, that gives you $20 off every device on esmining.io. That's my code. I get credit for it. I do get some money off of that. Uh, so and if, if you guys want me to tell you how much money I make off this, I don't mind. It's not that much because I'm a small channel, but it does give you that amount. Nonetheless, if you head over here to the cart, they've got shipping costs at a hundred bucks. So it's coming out to 819. That's with shipping. That's with the code. That's for an AL0 right now. Just to compare apples to kumquats, I went over to iServer's website, added an AL0 with the power supply shipping to, I'm not in Washington, but uh, they have their shipping at $55, but it comes out to more because their list price is $799 for the device. So it comes out to $873.90. So a little bit less over on Yes Mining. It makes certainly makes sense to check pricing at the various places before you buy one of these. But if you want to head over to Yes Mining, and grab one from them, support me, support them, support the channel, let them know that, uh, you know, supporting me is a good thing. Uh, head over to the link in the description below. So I don't have the device yet. Yes, mining claims that they are sending me a device, but I told them, hey, I got to do something different here. Everybody and their mother's putting out a video. Do you really need me to show you how to set up one of these home miners? They're simple as, as, as anything. Uh, super duper easy to set up. And I don't know that that's really going to get views or encourage people to check out Yes Mining. So I did something a little bit different. I did the thing that you're not supposed to do, and that's JBTC. I did a video on that not long ago where I just buy the coins. It's a common comment that people post in uh, mining videos, like, well, why would you buy a miner? Just buy the coin. So I went out and did it. Uh, and I don't know that that's gonna translate into a positive for a, <laughs> a potential uh, mining channel or a company that's trying to sell miners through my channel and promote them. Uh, but I'm loyal to the viewer and it remains to be seen and you might surmise that yes It certainly always makes sense to buy the coins, but not always prices could go down and yields could come up on the miners You could also resell the miner down the line to recapture a lot of the principal that you paid for it in and with if and when with a bull run comes back around and it all depends on the coin Alephium, uh, whether whatever you think about Alephium, I don't know I don't I'm not I don't look too deeply into these coins because they are all the same to me They are all garbage. They have no reason to exist uh, But I understand that a lot of people think they do and so that means that they're going to buy them That means it's going to be profitable. That means there's going to be price appreciation So, you know if Bitmain thought enough of Alephium of Blake 3 to put out a miner for it, then there must be something to it. That's not to say that I support or believe in the conspiracy theory that Bitmain artificially pumps the prices of coins for which they have made miners for, or algorithms of which they have made miners for, in order to sell more of those miners. Plenty of anecdotal evidence that would maybe support that, or circumstantial evidence that may support that. I don't know that that's true, but it certainly seems suspect. Whether they're doing it or not, I don't think it really matters because it's happened enough in the past and it seems like there's enough hype behind Alephium to where there should be price appreciation. So I'm going to go ahead and buy, boom, $800 worth of Alephium right now. And I'm going to assume that Yes Mining is sending out my miner right now. So it's as if I would have bought the miner at the same time I would have just bought the coins. And then we'll track it over time to see which one was the better decision. No, 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 no. This isn't me trying to pivot away from mining because I like mining. I like, I like to build stuff. I like the idea of machines that spit out money. But, you know, it's a sort of a common thing that people say, and it's certainly been true in the past in different instances. So it makes sense to try to uh, maybe do run this experiment, you know, test it out, see whether or not it made sense to buy the coin or to buy the miner or none or both or whatever. And I'm sure there are plenty of people out there that know precisely, or at least with some more precision than me, as to whether or not it certainly does make sense to do one or the other based on Alephium's technology, based on what it does, based on, on, this, on the, the winds, which way the winds are blowing as to whether or not people like Alephium or not, because 
I'm not doing the research into these coins. If you're coming to me looking for a, you know, expert insight into coins, you're in the wrong place, buddy, because I do not have the patience to look and read about these coins. So I'd love to know what you think in the comments below. Is this a good idea or a bad idea? Or like you're saying right now, technicals, you know that you're gonna do better just buying the coins. And yes, mining's not gonna like that because it's gonna demonstrate that the miner was not the best decision. Well, I don't know that. And so hopefully by the end of it, if it was or wasn't, then the viewer will be able to say, hey, at least he did the right thing in doing it, even though the sponsor may not like it. I don't know. Hope so anyway. If you would like to check out Yes Mining, links in the description below. Be sure to use code M20. That's my code. It gives you $20 off. Their pricing seems pretty good this time around for the AL0. Be sure to like this video for more content like this. And if you're not already, subscribe to the channel. I'm The Technicals. See you next time.